Hello, everybody. Uh, I'm going to center this small little episode thingy uh, more around the tilapia. Um, these ones are about three or four months old. I got them when they were about the size of that frontosia there, otherwise known as more of a fingerling size. Um, they're, uh, they came from a place in, uh, I think it was Tennessee. Um, but they were nice. Um, that right there is the male. He's one male surrounded by six females. Um, I'm pretty sure he's very attractive for the tilapia because originally he wasn't the, uh, the male that I had in here. I had um, a really big one, and I figured those are some cool genes to pass on for the pond. Um, but uh, nobody would look at him. The, the females didn't really want anything to do with him. He, uh, he made his nest, he flared his colors... He waved his uh, sexy tail in front of them, and they were like, ew, no. So he might have, I don't know, maybe he was like the Chris Farley or Jack Black of the tilapia world. I don't know. But uh, this guy um, is the uh, Brad Pitt of the tilapia world, I can tell. He's also 50 years old. Um, so, yeah, I've had two... Uh, eggs so far with this guy in a span of two weeks, so that's cool. Except the last one I uh, lost because uh, the mother decided to swallow them. Probably because she was too young. She's actually the smallest female I have. So that was her. Um, I don't know. Kind of sucked. But then uh, last time I showed you an egg tumbler I had going. As you can see, it is no longer there. Um, kind of, uh, upset me a bit. Overnight, uh, 300 tilapia eggs seem to, uh, have vanished in midair. Uh, if you can see with my potato, uh, camera, there's a little, there's a couple holes there. Well, I guess one of them, I'm looking at you, Brad Pitt, um, pretty much suckled all 300 eggs through the pantyhose. So, that was pretty annoying. I'm 0 for 3 as far as egg batches go. Um, mostly because I'm inept at uh, the mouth brooding type. Uh, I've kept aquariums for half my life, but I have not really centered that focus around African mouth brood types. I've been more of a South American type who lay their eggs on the ground and not in their mouth. But yeah, so hopefully um, I just changed the water so hopefully the females will uh, get in the mood and uh, I will definitely be putting the egg tumbler in another tank. Um, live and learn. Hopefully uh, Nobody will ever have that mistake again if uh, you watch this video. But yeah, that's uh, that's my tilapia. Um, bye.